Hi, my name is Kendra. And my name is Daniel, and we're a part of the Cal Poly Pomona American Society of Civil Engineers, and this is our series, STEM Kids, where we show you various civil engineering activities. Let's, Let's get started. started. Today, we will be talking about water filtration systems. Now, you may be wondering what a water filtration system is, or what it may be used for. Water filtration systems are used to filter water, or in other words, clean water. By filtering our water, we can remove contaminants that are harmful to our health and that get us sick. This is important because water filtration systems ensure that every time we open our faucets, drink water, or take showers, that we are provided with clean water that is safe to use. In today's video, we are going to show you how civil engineers create water filtration systems that provide us with safe water using common household items. To get started, let's go over the materials that you'll need. In order to create a dirty water sample, you are going to need one plastic bottle, some scissors, water, oil, and dirt. For the water filtration system, you will use a second water bottle, some cotton balls, gravel, and granulated activated carbon. The first step you'll need to do is cut one of the water bottles in half. When cutting the bottle, make sure to be careful to avoid any injuries. Now let's go over how these materials here will be used as filter materials to clean the water. The cotton balls help remove the smaller particles, while the gravel helps remove large particles. The granular activated carbon helps remove odor and color. Before we get started, make sure to rinse your activated carbon about three to five times and rinse your gravel to make sure your water runs clean. Both the gravel and activated carbon have already been rinsed before filming this video. Now take off the cap of the top half and face it down so the hole you drink from is facing down. Take a cotton ball and put it inside. Next, take the gravel and fill it up about halfway. Now that you've put in your gravel, put about three teaspoons of the granulated activated carbon inside. Put the top half of the water bottle inside the bottom half. And now we have a completed water filtration system. Daniel will show you how to create your dirty water sample and how the water filtration process works. To make the dirty water sample, we are going to cut the other water bottle in half. Since we are only going to utilize one top half, set the other one aside for recycling. We will add about water halfway. Next, we will add the dirt. and then two teaspoons of oil. And that's our dirty water sample. Now it's time for the water filtration process. Utilizing the water filtration created by Kendra, pour in the contaminated water. We can observe how when the dirty water passes through the filter materials, the water is noticeably cleaner. This is because the filter collects all the dirt and particles that make the water much cleaner. Note that no matter how much clean the water looks, please do not drink for safety reasons. Similarly, civil engineers design water filtration systems that clean our water. We hope you learned more about what civil engineers do and the important role they play in providing us with clean water. See you, See you next time with STEM Kids! kids.